Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video, we're going to be checking out another laundromat um, because I like checking out laundromats. So, uh, this one was submitted by a uh, subscriber. Uh, if you got a cool laundromat you want me to check out, put it down in the comments below. All right, let's see what this place is all about. Just type in their name in Google. Looks like they got a 4.5 on Google reviews. We'll check out that out later. 2.5 on Yelp and a five star on Facebook. But let's check out their website and uh, see what it's all about. Loading, loading, loading. Oh, this place looks pretty cool. All right, let's see their website. Lost, last wash daily at 6 p.m. Oh, look. I got a little chat and uh, I could ask them uh, a question. Organic laundry and dry cleaning. Pickup and delivery serving all of Union County. Okay, sweet. You can schedule a pickup right from the app. Looks like they got Hoi Hipsh. I almost said it. Hoi Psh. Hipsh. Um, so it looks like they only have the car readers on some of their machines. Uh, looks like they're doing, you know, maybe batch updating. These car readers are really expensive. Exploiter wash is about six hundred dollars per machine, so doing every single machine in your laundromat can get it quite expensive. Uh, Hipsh dryers, but it looks like they have. I don't know what these are. I'll have to see some more pictures. Um, cool light up here. It's fun. Black laundry tub. That's fun. Two changers. They got the. They're both singles. This one, I think, has a double hopper, but it's only got one bill validator. If you're going to do the double hopper, or the, you know, the double hopper, might as well get two bill validators. Um, because the bill validators are what really get jammed up all the time. Uh, let's see what kind of software they use for their pickups. Uh, pickups and drop-offs. Clean Cloud. Let's see what this is. Okay, so this is like a third party app. Let's see what the pricing is. Usually these things are about 30 bucks a, a month, 50 bucks a month. Okay, that's cool. Let's see what, see what else they got on their website. Hundred sixty likes on Facebook. Uh, they do wash and fold, organic dry cleaning. Okay, so this looks like their. Uh, I like their menu. Got on three TVs, sweet backsplash. I think their counter could be a little bit better. Looks like they got a scale right here. Okay, not a big place. Looks like about maybe fifteen hundred square feet. 52 machines, air conditioning, Wi-Fi, flatties, card and coin, phone chargers. They do the stainless steel tables. They got some grass, something up here. Okay, here's some more pictures. All right, they use fast card. Bathroom look nice. Uh, that's New Jersey. Okay, let's see what else their website has. Okay. No real links in their website. This is what... I thought they were 24-7. This one says last wash daily at 6 p.m. Oh. This one says 24 hour surveillance. Huh. I wonder which one it is. And then... See, they could open the store 24 hours. They just need to. It looks like they have a door here. They could build like a gate system or something, put the gate down when they're closed, but because 6 p.m. they're losing a lot of business by closing that early. All right, let's check out their uh, reviews. All right. Let's 
Let's see if we can uh, see what's going on here. Here's you get a good uh, idea of the business with the reviews. Five star, five star, five star, five star, one star. They say close at eight online. So, you know, that's the thing. Like, you close at 8, but the last wash is at 6. So somebody comes at 7 to wash their clothes. There's still time to wash their clothes, but they won't let them do the wash. That's the one bad thing with, uh, you know, have it fully attended. You got to have a cutoff sometime. Oh, here's the outside. Let's check out the outside. Oh, we should have looked at it. Oh, nice clean right in the plaza. Let's check out, see if we can find those dryers too. These are the hips, two loaders. 250 for these. I don't know what these are down here, but. Let's see if we can find those dryers. Hips, 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 everything hips. Uh, I don't think we will see from this photo. Oh, it's a video. Looks like Hitch too. Okay, let's go back to uh, the reviews. Nice atmosphere, 90s rock music on, Netflix. Yeah, it looks like the two bad reviews are based on uh, customer service. Okay, so this this review says three machines, and now they turn into a sixty-two dollar transaction. Uh, the machines, when you use the credit card, they do a uh, like a debit hold. So if you use three machines at sixty-two dollars, it looks like they charge about twenty dollars seventy-five cents for uh, a hold. And then uh, once it makes sure your account has the money, it'll change to you know like two dollars or six dollars. You know, instead of the customers, uh, the tenant saying, you know, how they do things, she just says they have nothing to do with it. So another bad review based on customer service a year ago. Uh, this is the owner says uh, new ownership. A lot of five star reviews. Oh, another bad review based on uh, uh, customer service. Another bad review based on customer service. So I feel like that's the, the name of the game at this laundromat. Nice, cool, trendy. Uh, newer machines, um, but you know employees can make a regular business. So let's see if there's anything else we have to check out this place. No, pretty cool looking business. Um, thanks for the suggestion. If you have any other suggestions of laundromats you want me to check out, throw them down in the comments below, and we'll see you next video.